Welcome to Chuck Builds. This is the second video in my Rage Against the Garage Door Opener series. I have a Rage Against the Garage Door Opener 2.5i right here, and we're gonna have to flash a firmware onto it before we can install it onto our garage door opener or gate opener. You need to first open Microsoft Edge or Google Chrome. This doesn't work in Brave or Firefox. It's a requirement of ESP Home Tools Web Flasher. And we're going to be on the website, paulwhelan.github.io, for his RAT GDO, Rage Against Garage Door Opener project. We're going to scroll down to Quick Start. And this top link here is for MQTT. That will do my other video. But in this video, we're doing ESP Home. So we'll click the ESP Home installer. And then we're going to plug in our Rage Against Garage Door Opener to the USB port. Once it's plugged in, we're going to make sure that our board is supported. I have the 2.5i right here and there's a wiring diagram if you need to use it. Otherwise, we'll scroll down and click connect, COM8, and then connect again. And we will install on this board, click erase, next, and confirm. So our installation is complete, so we'll click next. We now need to set up our Wi-Fi now that it's connected to the network, we can visit the device or add it to Home Assistant. Click Add to Home Assistant, Open Link, and then you would set it up here and you'd get all the dashboard settings that you would need. And we'll just go through it real quick. Inside of ESP Home for this garage door opener, we can see uh, all the controls and options and settings here to create our automations or just to get control of it into our dashboards. So at this time, you are done with the firmware for ESP Home. You can just set it up and you're good to go. If you wanted to go directly to the device, you could see the status of the ESP Home firmware on the device. And we'll have this collision detected while it's plugged in. Um, that'll go away once you get it set up on Wi-Fi, powered, and all your connections made. So at this time, you're done. You can go on to my next video to see how to install it onto your device. I have a video on a jack shaft garage door opener, a video on a arm swing gate, and I have a video on a non-LiftMaster Chamberlain MyQ uh, RAM set gate. Thanks for watching. Let me know if you have any issues, and if not, continue on to my next videos.